My name is Aimi Sarah George. I'm a senior this year, and I'm an international student from Singapore. I guess Gettysburg has given me a place to really hone my passion, and, and that's about getting involved in the community, because I think we're, we're all we're in college. We're one of the privileged 1% of the world that gets to go to college. Um, and so I've been glad to have made, an op made the most of those opportunities presented to me so that I can give back to my community in some small way, hopefully. The class that I'm taking and going on this trip to Nicaragua is um, the political science course, and it's called Women and the Political Economy of Development. And it's looking at the role of women in different societies. I could teach the course just as a course here on campus. Um, I decided that I would like an off-campus component to it and secured some funding for us to, to make the trip down to Nicaragua, which is neat because we actually have a, a long-term relationship down there with Project Gettysburg Leon in the community. So there's infrastructure on the ground there. There are people there to help with the planning and the scheduling. When you actually get to visit a place, you see the stories, you have women in mind that you've spoken to, whom you've met, and that's going to take on a whole new reality. Just by living in these households, they'll have a chance to observe and interact with these women and talk about them, about what they do in their daily lives. How do they allocate their time? What are the resources that come into the household? What kind of decision-making process goes on about how to allocate those resources to people in the household? I just honestly really like Professor Hartzell. Um, just the content that she, that she brings to class, it just really expands your mind and you're introduced to things that you wouldn't have otherwise. And the nice thing that she does with the classes is she makes connections again with, whether you're at the, looking at it at the international scope or the local scope. I mean, is someone that many people know of at this college because of her uh, involvement in many different sorts of activities, um, just her very positive spirit, lots of involvement, for example, in the Peace and Justice Studies Club, Center for Public Service, and I think she's able to make connections among all these different types of activities. The nice thing about being a residential campus is that you're not just in the classroom for a few hours a day and then that's the end of your school day. Um, you're going to take it back to, back to where you live, just so over a meal somewhere, you know. You're going to be talking about every other thing that college kids talk about, but somehow all these issues about community, about opportunities, you know, life issues, they permeate the, themselves into any topic or conversation. Time to come together, have, you know, philosophical discussions. I think as a liberal arts college, we do want to emphasize education for a lifetime. Learn, you know, know enough to, to keep yourself actively engaged in the process of learning for the rest of your life. And there's a lot at this college, I think, that lends itself to trying to foster that kind of passion and engagement. The concept of being a global citizen is a big thing that we talk about in class. And you know, it might be a uto utopian ideal. Um, you know, I try not to have my head in the clouds at the same time. I really believe community is the people around you. Every time people travel, something in you might want to think, you know, look at the differences between my home place and this new place that I'm in. But I'd like to think that there's so much more we have in common. And when you find that, you're able to relate to, an to another person on a much um, deeper level. And so what I'd like to do um, is probably get into international development. Um, and I'd really like to work at the grassroots level, working with community development initiatives, because I really believe in the power of working with the community and for the community um, and bettering people's lives that way.